Hey, Ocean Runner here. Each year in May and June, I see these green boxes out in the salt marsh. I have no idea what they are. Are they beehives? Are they bug boxes? I'm not sure. So I'm going to go talk to my friend Nikki at the Seacoast Science Center and see if she can tell me more. Come join me. Hey Nikki, I run by these boxes almost every day. These boxes are traps for the green-headed fly. They're put out as a natural way to control the bugs. They fly up underneath. They get trapped inside here. They have this screening over the top so that the birds can't rip this area open to eat the bugs. And they fall down on the sides. They should be cleaned out about once a week so that they're efficient. And, um, they do help control it. The green-headed flies live three to four weeks. Their first egg laying is about 200 eggs. And once they lay their first set of eggs, they need to get a blood nourishment meal, which is us, right? Which is us. <laughs> and they'll go to the upland areas and look for anything warm-blooded that they can bite. And most mosquito repellents don't affect them, so if you come to the beach, they're going to take a big chunk out of you. Oh, I've been I've been chunked by them before, and it yes. does not feel nice. Well, this is good to know because I've wondered this for years, and I know at the science center a lot of people ask about this, so now I know. Now you know. So thanks so much. Gotta run. See ya.